Having issues with your TP-Link Amada OC200 controller? Sometimes a factory reset is the best way to start fresh. In this video, I'll show you easy methods to reset your OC200 using the physical reset button. Let's get started. Hard reset using the reset button. First, locate the reset button on your OC200. It's a tiny pinhole usually on the side or back. You'll need a paper clip or a needle for this. Now power ON Omada controller and connect your computer or laptop from LAN port. Now use a paper clip or needle and press and hold reset button for 10 to 15 seconds to enable recovery mode. After 15 seconds open your web browser and type in the IP address 192.168.0253. You will get controller recovery page. Now press factory reset button and a confirm reset. Wait while controller resetting and restoring to default settings. This may take a few minutes. After reset, you can access controller with default login credential printed on the sticker. And that's it. A simple ways to factory reset your TP-Link Amada OC200 controller. If this helped, hit the like button and subscribe for more networking guides. Thanks for watching.